Okay. Uh, thank you for the introduction. Uh, it's my honor to talk to you today. Uh, actually, I'm a researcher of philosophy originally, but uh, <laughs> I happen to work for the University of Zurich, so um, I happen to be invited to this project by you sensei last year. So I have just started my study of tourism just last year, so it's a newcomer. <laughs> so uh, in Japanese, uh, what they are my uh, Today I'm just a reporter on some part of tourism in Japan. Uh, my case study, uh, especially the Harvey series. Then let me begin. My presentation consists of four parts, but the time is limited, so I have to focus on section two and section three in this presentation. I refer to the section one and four briefly. So oh, for the details of them, please read my handout. Uh, in the first place, what's subculture tourism? Uh, the researches on the content tourism are increasing in Japan recently. Uh, roughly speaking, the content tourism means a form of tourism. When we visit the location place of art or entertainment works such as movies, literary works, manga, and animes, that is called content tourism. This slide shows the image. Subculture tourism can be said to be one part of content tourism. Uh, subculture tourism has its subcategories like this. Uh, visits to museums and towns, events, pilgrimages. As you know, there are many subculture related events in Japan and all over the country. But what is peculiar to Japan is the existence of many anime or manga related museums. I'll show you some examples in the following slides. Uh, one of the most famous facilities related to manga artists is the Mizuki Shigeru Road in Sakai Minato. Totori Prefecture. As you know, Mizuki's masterpiece is Gegege no Kitaro. <laughs> As you know, the English title. Uh, this project started in 1993, and the main attraction is the statues of yokai characters. Plus, there is the memorial hall of Shigeru Mizuki and other attractions. It is said that the number of tourists visiting this road is about 3 million in 2011, last year, and the economic effects are about 96 billion yen. In Hyogo Prefecture, there is the Osano Tezuka Manga Museum. It was established in 1994. Tezuka was brought up in Takarazuka City, where this museum is located. Uh, next, uh, uh, this is the uh, uh, inside of the museums. Mm. In Hyogo Prefecture, uh, Kobe Tetsuji project is a relatively new project. It was started in 2006, and the 18 meter tall Tetsuji monument was built in 2009. The author of Tetsushi Nijiro Hachigo, or Mr. Yokoyama, was also brought up in Kobe, Yogo Prefecture. I have just mentioned three cases, but there are other several dozens of museums and tourist attractions related to manga artists in Japan. The next, uh, the phenomenon called Seiji Junrei, or the pilgrimage to anime sacred places, has become popular in Japan recently. Seiji Junrei means visiting to the location sites depicted in the anime. Uh, uh, sorry. As you can see in the slide, JNPO, or Japan National Tourism Organization, has already made the Japan anime map. And we can see this map on their website. The number of articles on this theme is increasing. Anime pilgrimage can be regarded as new type of phenomenon related to subculture tourism. Uh, Next, in summary, the study on subculture tourism has just begun. So we have a long way to go on this subject. Today I'll focus on the anime pilgrimage. Uh, then, what's the present situation of anime pilgrimage? I'll take up three points, as you can see on this slide. Uh, first, uh, how does an anime sacred place come into being? According to Yamamura, a pioneering researcher of content tourism at Hokkaido University, there are two types of formation patterns. One is the tourist leading type. In this type, the tourists or the pilgrims find the sacred place first and visit there. And after that, the local residents or governments notice the many tourists and they take some actions to use the movement to vitalize or develop their town. Lucky stuff and chaos, as you know, are included in this type. As shown in next slides, the main seiji or sacred place of both case is the semi-public space 
such as a shrine or a formal school building. Uh, this is the luckiest case. We can see the Washimiya shrine at Saitama Prefecture. Uh, this is the Keon case. The formal school building was used to get here. Uh, the second type is the film commission type. In this type, an uh, anime production and the local government enter into partnership in advance. Uh, Yamamura says that there is no great difference between anime and live action film in terms of tourism promotion. This type includes Summer Wars and Hanasaku Iroha, aired in last year. These are the two types of formation of anime seichi. Next. What activities are done by the pilgrims? Uh, pilgrims do various kinds of activities. On pilgrimage, they take photos, uh, express themselves, and they interact with each other or with local residents. <coughs> uh, these pictures are uh, taken from famous Senji Junde or anime pilgrimage blog Kibo Do. The writer of this blog, Mr. Kibo, is one of my important informants. As you can see, usually the shots taken in the anime and the shots taken in the real scenery are set side by side in the Seiji Jure box. And this one is another example. The blocks are very important tools for self expression of the pilgrims. We will discuss the pilgrimage note later. So, what's the Ita Ema? Uh, Ema is a small wooden tablet dedicated to shrine. Usually we write our prayers or wishes on it. You can see the spot like this when you visit to any shrine. In contrast to normal Emma or uh, which uh, which texts are written on Ita Emma, the anime characters are drawn largely. <laughs> I found a series of Ita Emas which was drawn probably one period when I went and inspected the Washimiya shrine. Which means that the enthusiastic fan had visited there for many times and had dedicated the divers one by one. Uh, the repetition of the pilgrimage is an interesting issue. Other than self-expression, the pilgrims' interaction with various people involved is also important. Uh, the success case of the interaction is Hajisai, a traditional festival at Washimiya, where the lucky star Mikoshi, the portable shrine, is nearly made and the fans and the local residents cooperated in creating the <laughs> festival booth. It's just small. But, uh, uh, after retiring home, uh, the pilgrims write their June day or pilgrimage blogs. There are enormous number of such kinds of blogs on the web, and some go so far as to publish the Dojinshi on their pilgrimage shown in the next slide. Uh, this slide. Uh, this is Harry case. Uh, this is one of the pilgrimage that are made by pounds. We can get the detailed explanation of the sacred places in the case, uh, in this case, Harry series. Well, that's all for the activities of pilgrims. Next question, what activities are there related to the pilgrimage? Three activities shown in this slide are important. Uh, let's take a look at them one by one. The most common activity would be the making and the distribution of maps. The, unco uh, the unofficial maps are made by fans, and we can download them on the web to use freely. As to the official maps, it's case by case. For example, we can download the maps of Summer Wars on the website of the local government freely, anytime. Sometimes the maps are distributed at the event site. The maps of Evangelion is this case. Holding event is also popular among various events. Uh, this is the KO case. Uh, I think what is most important, interesting case is that of Hanazuku Yoba. Uh, according to my interview and research on Yuwaku Super Tourist Association, more than, uh, oh, sorry. what's interesting about Hanazuku Yoba case is that they realized the fictional event, uh, Bombori Festival, uh, as a real event. <laughs> according to my interview and research on Yuwaku Super Tourist Associations, uh, more than 5,000 fans joined the event. Uh, this number was higher than expected. Uh, sales of goods are also very important for various stakeholders here. The success case is Lucky Star, Washimiya Game. According to Mr. Yang Matsumoto, the staff of Washimiya Commercial and the Industrial Association, the profits from the cell phone are 22 million yen. And the sales of this tsundari sauce <laughs> reached at 15,000 dollars. Washimiya is creating new products one after another. 
other places are also creating various products like this, Sengoku Basara Shiroishi uh, Shiro City, Miyagi Prefecture. Um, how is it? <laughs> and uh, this Tamaira case, Takehara City, um, Hiroshima Prefecture, uh, Sake and Rice. Uh, well, that's all I have to say about the presentation of the anime pilgrimage in general. Next, I report my case study, namely the melancholy of Haruji Suzumiya or the Haruji series. Uh, as you know, uh, Haruji series originally the light novel series, the first volume, the melancholy of Haruji Suzumiya was published in 2003. And last year, the 11th volume, The Astonishment of Haruhi Suzumiya, came out. Haruhi was made into TV anime series 2006 and 2009, and the film version of The Disappearance of Haruhi Suzumiya was released in 2010. Okay. Uh, Haruhi series was uh, the well-made Gakuen Mono story, a uh, life school story, uh, with the fact of science fiction and mysteries. We can regard Haruhi series as classics of last years, uh, last 10 years. There are many related books like this. Uh, Haruhi series is now still in progress, so what follows is just an intel report that will talk about the activity of the fans and those of the other people involved. On Panda. Haruhi fans do the typical activities of pilgrims, as you can see in this slide. Uh, there are numerous Haruhi pilgrimage blogs on the web. One of the most famous blogs is Kipo Do, I mentioned, uh, which has detailed information on Haruhi sacred places. It has more than one million access. Then, where is the central spot? Uh, this is the pilgrimage uh, Then, where is the central spot of Harvey pilgrimage compared to the Washimiya Shrine of Lucky Star or the former Toyosato Elementary School of Keio? Of course. The strongest candidate is the high school of Harvey and Harvey SSG Brigade members, but this building is the real high school, the Nishinomiya Chakopo. Also, the fans cannot enter into this site without much, of course. <laughs> But, uh, but once the fans intrusion, fans intrusion into the school site was reported in newspaper. <laughs> uh, this incident attracted the attention not only of Japanese, but also those of fans overseas. I found the English speakers forum discussing this issue all the way. So, in actuality, the central spot is Cafe Dream, where is the model for the Cafe SOS Brigade members frequently get together to hold a meeting. Uh, Harvey Corner is located. Uh, nearest difference. Uh, we can read Harvey related books and write in the pilgrimage not free. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> uh, on 17th, December 2010, uh, the party was held in honor of Cafe Dream, which was organized by an enthusiast fan, Mr. Chauke. Uh, this is of course Harvey. Uh, where over 40 fans attended to show their gratitude to the shop owner, Mr. Hosomi. The present was given to him. This event was also reported in local newspapers. Uh, six years ago, the year the Harvey first anime series was broadcast, this fan held a sampler event planned as a part of the Dojinshi exhibition and sale. This event was operated completely by volunteer staff, and according to Mr. Mizukoshi, one of the staff, the number of participants are about 80. The youngest was a junior high school student. The oldest was a man of his studies. What is interesting for me is the fact that fans are creating high quality tourist attractions for themselves without any pay. Another interesting movement is that Mr. Chauke made a detailed map, an official map in cooperation with local merchants such as a bookstore, a in the region, and a community website last year. As you can see, how the sacred places are scattered in all hours of in all around the uh, Kansai area, especially in Nishinomiya city. This map was distributed to the purchasers of the latest volume of Haruhi at the bookstore, and some are displayed at the storefront of some shops which are here, uh, which are depicted in the anime series. Uh, this is the case, and uh, uh, this is another case. The owner of this drugstore said to us that, especially in weekends, a fan or a small group of fans frequently visits to his 